Hello y'all, this is George and Shannon from Real Deal Randall Knots and Urbex coming at you. We're doing another nighttime geocache. And uh, we have uh, really gotten crazy about the geocache, it's pretty cool. So uh, Shannon is uh, pulling up a point. Uh, just wanted to tell you, hit the like button, the subscribe button, notifications. Go to our buddies at Geeked Up Paranormal, Brianna and Brandon, and uh, subscribe to them. If they get to 100 subscribers, Brandon's going to do the One Chip Challenge. And if, when we get to the 50, 50 subscribers, I'm going to do the One Chip Challenge. Hopefully we can do it together, and maybe, maybe we'll do it at a haunted location. So, all that being said, uh, let's see what we got here on... Uh, I got one, it's up on Freedom's Way. The, uh, I can't even think, I lost my train of thought. On uh, Geocache. Geocache. Couldn't think of it. So, I'm going to hand the camera back to Shannon. I got the point. There you go. And it is four minutes away, two miles. All right, four minutes away and two miles. We'll see you then. Okay, guys. I hate this camera. Anyway, we're right here on it, so we're getting out. There I am. It's very dark. Uh, it is. It's right here in the guardrail. You gonna see that? <laughs> you already find it? Yep. <laughs> it was right behind the caution thing, like you said. Will you open it? Yep. Alrighty, let's see what this is. Oops, it's falling over. So sorry about the road noise, guys. Yeah, really sorry. Is that the log or is this the log? This hasn't been since January. Yay! Oh, that log is full. No wonder they started this one. Okay, I didn't see this side. Okay, so. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Oh. It is a refresh your cup thingy. Crap, I can't write like this. Hold on. Oh, man. And Shannon, four twenty six twenty one. All right, and I am putting a little apple trinket in there, and of course, our business card with our name written on it. All right, so I'm gonna go put this back. You see that? Yeah, that's what was in there. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the apple. There's a business card. And here is the new log sheet. Alright. And then, before I put it back, I will go back on the phone 
and mug that we found it. Yay! So we'll be back in a little while. We're gonna hit the next one up and then we'll uh, show you when we get there. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay, y'all. Sorry I didn't show you the point when we got it, but we just got here. Then we'll take George's big light and go see what we can see. Oh God, blind me. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, <laughs> I'm blind. Look, is that poop? That looks kind of sketchy. What I'm seeing is kind of sketchy. It's got stuff in it. Okay, going back to the car. Sorry for the road noise and for having you guys upside down. This one was stuck into the stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it's gross. Mm. Can you see it? Is there enough light in here? It's a little dark, here? but it's all right. Extra log. Marbles. Oh, cool. <coughs> I have a little heart to put in there. And let me set this down because it's gross. And a business card. Go ahead and stick it in there. And then we'll sign the log. It looks like it's pretty full. That one looks like it's been here for a while, the container. Yeah. 126.21, somebody did this just like we are, the same night or whatever. Yeah, but that was back in January. Yeah, but they, the last one was the same day in January oh. and the same person, so. Oh. G and F. 4, 26, 21. By the way, big shout out. It's my mom's birthday, and she's the one that supplied us with all these little trinkets. Happy birthday, Rachel. Yay, mommy. Rachel. Bag on the seal back, right? It looks like something was trying to make a nest in there. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go put it back, right, and then we'll see you all at the next one, or I will. Did I just close it? Yep. Okay, y'all, uh, we just got to our next spot. So, oh, crap, the door hit the guardrail. <laughs> Man, you don't know how much fun this is. Oh, really? It looks like somebody took this one. Here, here's a stick. I'll dig in there with a stick. It's not a stick, it's a piece of metal. Ugh. 
Well, it looks like somebody's taking it. It's not there. There's a marble on the ground. Oh, God. Let me get the marble. Somebody's taking the thing. <clears throat> That is so rude, man. There's another marble. Ugh. I don't have a container on me or I'd put it back in there. Man, that really sucks. Hold on, y'all. I'm going to pause for a minute. I'm going to see if I have a container. It's like this little dot blinking. Yeah. Okay. Okay guys, the bottle or whatever was gone, so I found my, an aspirin bottle in my purse. I'm putting it back in. Here's our business card. And it, crap, one of the marbles is fell in. There's another marble. And our contribution is a little plastic paper clip or safety pin. Isn't it cute? And I'm going to write our thing on it. Here's what's odd was, as we was coming up the road, we saw a car parked on the side of the road in this exact spot. And we found the bottle that was there crushed, over there. crushed on the side of the guardrail. And one of the marbles laying on the ground and the other marble laying inside of the, where the geocache was. It was very <clears throat> rude for somebody to yeah. do. So we fixed it. So this counts as a find, right? No, it counts as a didn't find. Counts as a did not find. But repaired. But repaired. I don't know how that works. So, oh, I can pick my purse. Let me put it on back. So. Let me go put this back. That was very rude of them to do that, and I don't appreciate that a bit. Oh, there went the door hitting the guardrail again. Well, she's hitting the guardrail. I got. To, I parked it a little too close over here. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. <coughs> Had to flip the camera around and so I could see my pretty face. I don't, I cannot get my face lined up with this thing. Anyway, shouts out to Geeked Up Paranormal. Like and subscribe to them. Good people, good friends of ours. Brandon and Brianna. You got to go geocaching with us, guys. This is a blast. This is fun. Okay, so Shannon's getting ready to generate a... Yeah, we can do this one. Well, I got to... Write what happened. Oh, okay. So you got to write down what happened. Oops, sorry about that. Good. Write note. Okay. Cash was not there. Only two marbles. Replaced. Anyway, as you can tell, it's very, very dark out there. And we're on the highway, so it's a little dangerous to be parked here. And it is, right now, it is, what, 1040 at night in the p.m. There's a little house on the hill way over there. Anyway, I'm going to click off here for a minute, and we're going to get to our next point. Be right back, y'all. Okay, y'all, we're at our destination, but the bad thing is, is it's in a shopping center. So I hope it'd still be here. It says, Sons. I sure don't see it back there, though. I bet somebody's taken it and done something with it. Could it be inside here? I don't see it anywhere. Yeah, I think somebody may have done something with it because that's easy to. Ooh, don't step in that. And you just did.
Okay, y'all, we just came up here and looked all around that box there. Y'all looked around it too. <laughs> and there was nothing there. And it said signs, and that's what it says on that box of signs. So I had to put, I did not find. And now I pulled up another one that's half a mile and three minutes away from here. I'm just hoping Head somebody. Head southeast toward Midland Boulevard. I just hope somebody's not going to these points before we're getting there and. And doing something because. Taking them because. We find stuff at every one of these points usually. Yeah. And uh, and that's not right, you know. If somebody's playing a game, you shouldn't ruin their stuff, you know. No, no. You don't. You don't do that. I mean, it's we're out here spending our time doing it, and hell, it's eleven o'clock at night, uh, and we're trying to have a little fun. Sorry about that. <laughs> so we'll see you at the next one. You got the forty-eight thousand lumen out here. <laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, we just pulled up here. It's on the edge of this little circle here, so we're going to get out and do our worst. No, I'm just kidding. And it says it's in a free place. And we found the sign that says tobacco free. Ah, I got it. One they didn't find. Ugh. All right, let's get back in the car and Check do her up. up. Yeah. Everybody's using these little mint boxes. Well, I'll turn my light off then. Mm -hmm. Maybe yeah. I got tweezers. Oh on my no, phone. top people. Yeah, I'm gonna need the tweezers. It's a very important tool in geocaching. We found out the tweezers. Because my little grubby fingers oh, won't fit up in there. Oh, and it was wet. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, gross. <laughs> and okay. a little apple in there. Okay, geocache guys, these things are not properly sealed. <laughs> we Ugh. just got water all over our phones, all over her. Oh, I'm going to be sick. That uh, and that was stale water. Mm, let me wipe my hands off real quick. Oh, God. We are big time germaphobes, in case you didn't know. Mm. I should be doing this with gloves. My mama told me to do this with gloves. My mama said. Mama said, mama said, mama said. Paper's still damp even though it was in there. 224.21 was the last time. Oh, February. Right here. Ah. Sorry about that, fellas and gals. <laughs> I was moving the camera where she could find the thing thinking it was a light but it was a camera because I have no technical abilities good <laughs> it really doesn't <clears throat> okay but I can sew anything yep and I can put your brakes on that she can I've seen her do it all right get in my trinket bag that my mommy gave me Ugh. Again, like and subscribe. I mean, we're doing geocache videos now, but uh, we got some cemeteries coming up that are going to be good, I promise you. How about a penny with footprints stamped yeah. in it? That's cool. I'm going to put it in the little bag, that way it doesn't get green. Oh, and I forgot the business card. Don't. Don't. So yeah, like I said, we've got uh, some cemeteries coming up, hopefully a group of those, and uh, those will be interesting because we're going to try to prove a theory, well we know we proved a theory, ghosts come out during the day as well as, well as at night. We've already proved that at the 
knife house and uh, not only ghosts but demons so uh, we're going to uh, be hitting up quite a few cemeteries here before long during the day all right i'm gonna go put this back you just now i can see it <laughs> okay well here we are at night I don't know if you can see anything out here, but it's nighttime and it's a pretty sketchy place. But look at that moon, man! Look at that moon up there, it's bad. But the place itself is kind of sketchy. Oops, I did that backwards again. <laughs> Mm -mm. Man, I am terrible at this. I am so sorry about the camera work, guys. Some hand sanitizing. So, okay, I'm going to uh, flip this around and we'll head to the next. Okay, here we are. It says at a well guarded, what did it say? Well guarded light pole. Well guarded light pole. Well, here we are at Walgreens. And there's a light pole. And it's got guardrails and big fence. Ah, there's that's the clue. That's the clue. Really, did they ever clean the parking lot? Look at oh, you can't see it's too dark. This is in the guardrail. Let's see. I guess it's the light pole because. Aha, this thing looks up. Me think. Me think it does. Here it is. Yay! Oh, that's right. Now I go back to the car and. I'm glad it was there instead of here because that's a diaper. Yuck. People really don't litter. So oh, I'm blind from looking at that light of his. So nasty. Because not more than a hundred feet away is a. Uh, is a uh, trash can. All I had to do was drive over there. Smalls. <laughs> I must say, geocache. It's the most interesting and fun thing. It's very interesting, very fun. And oh, let me wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, flower. Let me tell you guys, it's a little dangerous, a little. A little oh, sketchy wow. at night. There's a rock in there. There's little plastic Trinkets. eyeballs. There's an apple. There's an earring. This is the old list, evidently, because it is majorly written on. But we're really having a good time doing this stuff. Uh, Four sixteen. So somebody was just here not too long ago. We find it very interesting and gets our mind to working too with the riddles that they they give you that you try to figure out. And this thing is pretty cool. And at least we're finding things. Yeah. Unlike a game that name will not be mentioned. Oh, I said it earlier. Well, I'm vowing not to mentioning it. Rando <laughs> Snotica. Rando Snotica. We have it. We've played it numerous times, numerous, numerous hours a day. Haven't found anything. Has had some sketchy stuff happen, but 
Not much more than that. Look at that shell. Mm -hmm. It's too big to go in there, though. Yeah. There's a Kentucky fan. Yeah. That's a little, little Tinkerbell. Little Tinkerbell, that'd be good. I'm not going to take anything. I like to leave stuff. Oh no! I've got to get that shell. And again, thank you, Mama, for the stuff. Thank you very much. I got tired of leaving coins. Yeah, we could use them. <laughs> oh, I gotta get that. No, that's cod. So, again, here we are in the night. There is the light pole up there. I don't know if you can see it or not. Uh, but it's very dark out here. And there is a car parked over there. I don't know if you can see it or not. Yeah. But that is kind of sketch. I didn't see that when we pulled up. Not wanting to close now. We're going to need to get a bigger container. We're going to need a bigger boat. We're gonna need a bigger boat, she said. <sighs> no copyright intended. None. Yeah, yeah. Here, see if you can get close. Oh, that was my shoulder. I don't know if we can just get it back in the box. I mean, in the bag. Lord God, what's wrong with me? We need to remember to bring a couple of baggies with us next time we come out there. Yeah. And each time you find one, guys, you got to go back to this log thing. And then click found it. And then it'll come up and it'll want you to write a little note. So. Here, I'll just, I'm going to go put it back. You're going to put it back? Yeah. Okay. So he's going to go put it back. I'm going to write a note. And then we're going to do one more and go home for the night. So we will see you at the next one. I really hope you're enjoying it because we are. Okay, y'all. We just uh, got done with uh, our last geocache of the night. It's getting late and we're very tired. We've had a really good time doing this and we got many more to do. Plus cemeteries and abandoned places. Yeah, we're just doing it all, man. Paranormal. Uh, yeah, we'll go look for Bigfoot, Mothman. Mm -hmm. I'll look for a flying pig if I can find one. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, I'll hit the like and subscribe and the notifications. Doesn't cost you a dime. Doesn't take any time. And it helps us. That car looked like a ladybug. It was dressed up as That's a ladybug. Funny as hell. Anyway, uh, it, it helps our channel out. We don't get paid to do this. My hair was in it. I'm sorry. Oh, no. <laughs> well, you know, we don't get paid to do this. We, we're using our own dime to do this. We're not asking for money. All we're asking for is likes and subs subscriptions. Click, click. Click, click. That's all it takes. Hit subscribe. Uh, that being said, thank you again for being with us. Hope you enjoy these geocaches as much as we do. Uh, Shout out to Rachel, my mother-in-law, Shannon's mommy. Uh, happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. You still got another half hour or a little bit more of birthday. And thanks for the trinkets. Thanks for the trinkets and thanks for watching Abe's. Our doggy. And uh, shout out to uh, Brianna and Brandon from Geek Dip Paranormal. Get them uh, liked and subscribed as well. The good people. And the we, channel's good. And who are we? We are real deal random knots and urbex. Now he finally gets it. Finally get it out there. RDRU. That's right. So watch our channel and enjoy. We will talk to you very soon.